What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Jay Davies with another video, and today is a follow up to my other video, Go See the Doctor. So, this would be Go See the Doctor Part 2. Uh, had to come up here, I already had my blood work done, uh, lost a few pounds, uh, blood pressure is good. Stupid A1C went up. Uh, when I looked at the report, I believe it was 8.2, but Doc says it's 8.4. So he was trying to get me on metformin, which I said no go because I did research and a couple of my friends told me that metformin is, it doesn't react well to people of color and it messes with your kidneys and, uh, just a whole bunch of stuff that I don't want to go through. Uh, and I got to take this call. So hold Sorry about that. I'm back. Uh, family called to check up on me, which is always much appreciated. But yeah, uh, other than that, good checkup with the doc. And uh, they did give me the what's that hepatitis B vaccine because he said that my body doesn't have enough antibodies built up to protect me from it so they gave me a shot oh let's see I guess you guys can see that the uh, nurse stuck me and she's putting the band-aid on and I'm looking down I said uh oh I'm leaking so she gave me another band-aid to put on it so I gotta come back out here in two months uh, like I said, I'm not taking that metformin crap. I have enough health uh, issues that I don't need to be compounded with that crap. So he said he was going to put me on the uh, Rebelsis, uh, which he said that it um, when you eat and you're on that medication, it'll make you feel like you're full or you get fuller faster. And he said that one of the uh, side effects of it is that uh, it, it cuts your appetite so you don't feel like you're hungry as often. And that people uh, lose weight on it. And I know some of my friends and family probably say, that's a good thing because you need to lose weight anyway. Ha, ha, ha. But uh, other than that, I'm sitting here in the parking lot of the medical facility, which... Where I'm zooming in at over there. Uh, let's see where I think right directly straight ahead. That room is where I had to come to for four months for physical therapy. Uh, after my car accident, was, um, the accident happened out here in Taylor, Michigan, where I met Taylor and Eureka. I had to have therapy for four months, two months for my shoulder and my neck and then the other two months for my back. So two days a week, I had to come out here 45 minutes and I was still working at the time because my injuries I didn't know the full extent of my injuries at the time but I was able to still work but those four months were a pain in the ass because like I said I had to come out here uh, I had a great um, what's the word I'm looking for a uh, physical therapist uh, Joel a uh, great guy he would work me out for 45 minutes that I'd have to drive all the way back home and then drive all the way back out here uh, to work I guess I can say because I don't work there anymore uh, Dakota uh, shout out to my peeps at Dakota, you know who you are. Uh, yeah, I had to come out, come back out here and work for, shoot, nine, ten hours. And then go back home. So, those days that I did physical therapy were very, uh, tiresome. And I remember one of those days I had to have a, uh, tetanus shot, so... I'm like, I'm already out here doing physical therapy. I know I gotta slave away at this job nine to 10 hours. Now you wanna stick me in my freaking arm like a pig cushion. So I told you that already stuck me today, but it's for my good. But 
I am going to get out of here and go pop in on mobs because I believe probably in front of my camera but there are some bad uh, clouds coming someone just told me that uh, ooh, there I am that uh, a bad storm is coming this way okay I uh, want to make sure the camera's still rolling I don't want to be talking to myself for the hell of it and that I should probably get out of Dodge. I would go check in on mobs, uh, have lunch, play cards, as per usual. Uh, and I pray to God that I can get out of here and get there expeditiously because on my way up here, I got caught by the freaking train. That thank God it wasn't a long train, but I did see a few people. Uh, I don't know what their schedule is. They had to do a u-turn to get out of there so with that being said i'm going to mosey mosey up out of here and before i get to driving i'm gonna say my prayer that i always say lord please watch over me on my travels to and from and while at my destination in jesus name i pray and now that i've talked to the lord i have a favor to ask of you guys if you could please hit the light button like share comment subscribe and please turn on all post notifications so that every time i drop a video good bad otherwise you will be notified uh, that will really help me out so i'm going to start up dj here dj is i call my car dusty jr the other one that was stolen from me that was the original dusty that's a whole nother uh topic hold other video that i could go in on but i won't so let me get my uh, seat belt on uh, safety first yes sir Whew. and i see this lady in front of me and i bet you let's see i don't really want to show her but i bet you as soon as i start my car up she's going to back up yep as soon as i said it she heard me so you guys can see i'm not telling no lies he was parked right in front of me and as usual as soon as i thought about uh starting my car she backed up so now that she's out the way let's uh go ahead and start this bad boy up yes sir all righty make sure it's dry let me get out this freaking parking lot I pray that nobody is coming. Yes, sir. So, let you guys see what I see because be a lot of foolishness coming out this parking lot. I'm not going to show the address to the building of my doctor. Keep some things private. You understand me? Hold on, little red Corvette or whatever. Yep, that's you, buddy. Dang, anybody in mama want to come out here? Now that I'm coming out here, I guess I just put my blinker on, huh? And another one. And here comes somebody else. Good Lord Jesus, I'm going to be sitting here for a minute. Another one. Come on, DJ. Oh, come on, lady. Get the stepping. Jesus. Anybody their mama had to go to the doctor's office today, I guess. All uh, this freaking construction out here. Shout out to all the construction workers of Michigan. And uh, I don't know what the hell is going on. I don't know if it's a, a Detroit thing or a Taylor, Michigan thing, but all up and down uh Telegraph is major construction. Uh, I know when I came out here this morning, it was uh, three lanes condensed down to one. And now that I'm trying to go home, everybody, their mama's going the same way. So when I say traffic is backed up and jacked up, I'm telling no lies. 
And you got the, uh, come on, y'all, move up just a little bit. <sighs> Jesus. If y'all could, Udo, Dos, Trace, Quattro, all four of y'all just come to hello so I can get over. All right, it's clear. Yes, sir. And can I go over there? Jesus Christ. All right. Yep. Coming through, coming through, coming through. I got to deal with this, guys. Every time I come out here, and it's not a fun experience. Not fun at all. And you got to sit here because I'll just show it. You got traffic coming that way. And then you got people coming out here. So it's, uh, damn. It's like playing Frogger every time I come out here. And there's cars behind me, but they're going to have to wait. All right, somebody going. What you going to do? I can't. Oh, Jesus Christ. All right. Oh, woo. Got to be quick. Got to be quick. So, yeah, this is what I get to see. On my way home. Toledo and Detroit. So, oh, boy. But, uh, yeah, so this is what I have to deal with on an every, not an everyday basis because I don't come out here that often. Thank you, good Lord Jesus. But, uh, like I said, just had to do a uh, follow-up, come back to the doctor, and uh, with the exception of my A1C, everything is good. Hopefully this new medication, Rebelsis, if I'm saying that correctly, will make it even better and so far so good I don't see a train up there and I oh yeah I said I was going shoot I gotta get in the right left lane I just thought about something I said I was gonna do while I was out here since the store out here I like to stop at it put my numbers in it's usually uh, it's a great guy that works out here at the store, his name is John. Good day. Can't really speak for the other guy that worked behind the counter because every time I go in there, it seems like he got to stick up his ass about something. So hopefully, get that notification off of there. Uh, he won't be there. I know these people probably looking at me like, why is he talking to a camera? Don't worry about it. Mind your beeswax. Uh, but so far so good oh, okay that's the street uh let's see if i get that allen road if y'all can see that that's down there where the train was at uh yeah so uh no train right now and i can't see deputy dog but i can feel a disturbance in the force so with that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and concentrate on the road. And next time I see you guys, I shall be at Bob's house, pop in on her. And uh, yeah, let me go and get off this camera because they started to drive kind of crazy. See you in a bit, guys. Peace. Yeah, guys, I'm back for a quick second. I uh, forgot that I was gonna stop somewhere. And uh, yes, yeah, sir. One of my favorite uh, liquor stores, party stores, if you will, in the fine state of Michigan that I like to uh, frequent when I need to uh, get some scratch offs and play my numbers. Like I said, most of the people in here are very friendly, especially one of the main guys that runs it. His name is John, his other co workers. Well, the other guy's cool, the other guy, he's an ass, I'll just say it. So, for real, for real, I'm a pop in here. Safety first. Yes, sir. I try to catch nothing but a number. Mega Millions, Powerball, all of the above. So next time you guys see me, it will definitely be at Bob's house. See you in a second. <sighs> well, guys, like I said, I made it to my final destination for today. 
If somebody don't know who that is, it's sitting on the side of the house. So, yep, to the vlog. I'm glad you keep on going. Probably shouldn't have been here any dog old way. Because uh, as you can see, what's that sign say? Private property, no trespassing. Yes, sir. And I know Bob's don't own the street, but this is inside of her house. So with that being said, let me pull up a little bit because uh, I don't like parking by that sewer. So yeah, uh, up over here, I don't know who the hell that was, but uh, I'm glad they drove off because when it comes to my mama, you mess with her and it's a whole other ball game. And my favorite phrase is, don't start no shit, won't be no shit. So with that being said, I'm going to pop in and check up on moms. And I think I'm going to end this video because my sinuses is kicking my ass. And I don't know if you can tell, but uh, we are for some rough weather. I just came from... Uh, Taylor, Michigan, and uh, it looked like all hell about to break loose, so hopefully it won't be that bad, and I pray that the everybody's power stays on. So with that being said, this is your boy Jay Davies checking out with another video. Uh, thank you guys so much uh, for checking me out. Uh, do me a huge favor. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Yeah, I know my hair is jacked up, but it is what it is. Uh, like, comment, share, subscribe, and please click that post notification bell. So every time your boy drop a video, good, bad, or otherwise, you will be notified when I drop. Um, some things coming up with the uh, DJs, DJ T or Ted just said they got a uh, show coming up October 8th. So hopefully I can uh, get some footage for that. And until next time, Peace.